Hello. Day 29. I have almost known about all this for a month. A month, a full month. Sheesh. I slept for mm, about an hour and a half this afternoon. <laughs> Here I thought I was going to go to Indy. Uh, the days, the days are amazingly fast. Like everything is in slow motion, but it's all amazingly fast. So the things I think I'm going to get done, I don't. And other things come up and happen and they're fabulous. Like um, my friend Chandra came over and uh, she gave me a healing meditative yoga session. And um, that really was great. Um, I was able to really just get out of my, my me phase my heady phase and into my souls and phase. <laughs> and what I'm looking for right now are places to go when I start um, my treatments on Monday, because it'll be nice to uh, just have some new material for my mind to go to, you know? Um, I'm actually really looking forward to starting because what I feel now is just a drag and it and it just it's old you know it's not going away um, even with my ibuprofen you know the first day I took that mega amount it was like whoa I didn't feel anything and I could just work out and eat and then the next day it was like eh, I still kind of feel stuff but I, I can still eat but I can start I can feel it and today I'm like yeah, I still feel everything. <laughs> yeah, I can I can eat, but not it doesn't feel good anymore. So that wore off fast. Shoot, I'm gonna have to tell the doctor about that because, um, darn. Mm. But I'm still forcing myself to eat and drink, and I have gained two pounds, people. Yes, that's exciting news. I weigh myself every single morning. Matthew purchased a very high tech scale. I put this little monitor around my chest, um, right here at my at my uh, sternum, and it monitors my my weight, oxygen, blood, BMI, water. Um, I'm probably forgetting things, but it's like one of those <laughs> all encompassing. And uh, so I've been doing it every morning for the past. I think I got this two weeks ago, week and a half ago, anyway. And my weight was fluctuating then between 109 and 110. I'm proud to say I'm at 112.4 today. Mm, that's a do, do, two thumbs up. <laughs> that's really, really good news. Uh, I think a lot of it has to do with, um, you know, it's like, yes, I know I have to eat, but now it's like, you have to eat. <laughs> you have to eat to live. Uh, you have to eat to take this treatment. You know, Donna, eat. Doesn't matter if it feels horrible. Doesn't matter if it tastes good or bad. And it does kind of feel yucky, I have to say. Every time I eat, I'm like, oh my God. But, I'm gaining weight and that's what's important. So yay me. <sighs> yeah. So three days I can do another two plus pounds. Mm-hmm. That's my goal. That's a goal. That's a good goal. I'm good with that. Um, let's see what's going on. I, uh, like I was saying, I took a nice big nap after uh, Chandra was here. We, Matthew and I, had a nice lunch and we watched our show and then I passed out for like an hour and a half, but I slept funky. I slept wrong. I must have had my, I'm not even sure what direction my neck was at, but it's like, oh, not that my neck hurts, but it kind of gave me a, like a pressure headache. And you would think that the Tylenol or not the Tylenol, the ibuprofen would be kicking it, but it isn't. So bummer on that. Um, it probably has too many areas to, to battle right now. It's like, oh, pancreas, poop, poop, poop. Yeah. <laughs> Lymph node, poof, poof. 
Oh shoot, brain. God, durr, gotta get up there. Bam, bam, bam. So hopefully it's gonna pop that up. Because <laughs> having a headache sucks. And I have a tendency to go into a migraine. I haven't had one for a long while, but because there's, like I said, so many other places to uh, that my body's trying to heal. Um, anyway, go away. Go away. You are not wanted. <laughs> okay. It's already bedtime. And I realized that I hadn't even gotten on and blo vlog vlogged, vlogged anything today. So, um, I have some fun stories again, but I'm not going there tonight because like I said, my head's a little, that was a good sound. Anyway, um, tomorrow, tomorrow's a new day. It's not going to be windy. Oh, I could have, it could be a, a wind thing too. Oh, it's very, 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 very windy today. That could be why I have a head issue. Sometimes it's kind of. A little bit of an allergy related thing and dryness. Maybe I'm dehydrated. Anyway, we'll figure it out. I plan on sleeping really well tonight and waking up tomorrow. And I'm going to be taken to the ranch because I didn't go today. Today was a blip and gone poof. I'll go tomorrow. I don't know what I'll do, but at least I'll go. Let my poor boy know that I'm alive and that I love him and I miss him and I want him. And um, I should just bring him home and bring him in the house like I did when I was nine. <laughs> Matthew heard that. <laughs> He's like, mm, I think not. <laughs> um, Indy'd love it. He's the kind of horse, <laughs> he'd like sit on the couch with us and eat popcorn if he could. Watch a show. He'd chill. He'd love it. He's so cute. Oh, just won't kiss him. So that is my hopeful plan for tomorrow. That need a lot of food. Mm-hmm. So I will have some stories tomorrow. Like I said, I have some funny ones, but my brain just doesn't want to, just doesn't want to handle the, uh, the effort <laughs> that it takes to talk and, and smile and tell stories. So tomorrow. Good night, everybody. I love you. I love me. What show is that? Like the dating game or something? Whatever. Good night.